Welcome to my channel, Technology in the Future. The Fujifilm X-Pro series has long been a cornerstone of the company's lineup, cherished by photographers for its luxurious design and exceptional performance. With the X-Pro 3 having been released over three years ago, fans are eagerly awaiting the announcement of its successor, the X-Pro 4. In this article, we will delve into the latest rumors and speculations surrounding the X-Pro 4, as well as explore potential changes that Fujifilm might implement in future camera models. The X-Pro series, a legacy of excellence and luxury. The X-Pro series has consistently been a favorite among Fujifilm users, renowned for its premium design and exceptional image quality. However, with stocks of the X-Pro 3 nearly depleted, speculation is growing that Fujifilm may soon announce the X-Pro 4. This anticipation is fueled by the increasing demand for a new mid-range or high-end flagship camera, leaving many wondering what advancements the X-Pro 4 might bring. Rumors about the X-Pro 4 began circulating earlier this year, and according to reliable sources, this camera is expected to be a game-changer. At the heart of the X-Pro 4 will likely be a 40-megapixel APS-C X-Trans 5BSI sensor, paired with the state-of-the-art X-Processor 5 for image processing. This combination is anticipated to enable stunning 4K video recording at 60fps in high-quality 10-bit format, elevating the X-Pro series to new heights. One of the most exciting rumored upgrades is the long-awaited 7-stop in-body image stabilization. This feature would significantly enhance the camera's capabilities, making it an even more attractive option for both photographers and videographers. Additionally, Fujifilm is expected to introduce a new user interface and menu system, along with an autofocus system similar to the one found in the latest Fujifilm X-T5. These enhancements could make the X-Pro for an appealing upgrade for users of older X-Pro models. Fujifilm is facing fierce global competition, and to regain its original fan base, the company appears to be aiming to offer a range of cameras across different price segments. There is speculation that Fujifilm might transform the X-Pro series into a luxury line that can compete with Leica M cameras. This transformation could include increasing the size and magnification of the electronic viewfinder, implementing a new autofocus system, and improving the overall build quality to provide a more luxurious look and feel. However, Fujifilm may not launch its next-generation flagship camera until it introduces a new high-end sensor, which could breathe new life into the entire X-Pro lineup. This potential new sensor could build on the success of models like the Fujifilm X-T5 and X-H2, offering further improvements in image quality and performance. One of the challenges Fujifilm might face in developing the X-Pro4 is incorporating features that have traditionally been the hallmark of Leica M cameras. For example, Leica's approach to optical viewfinder frames has its unique quirks, and integrating an 18mm frame into the X-Pro4 could be challenging. However, the X-Pro2's optical viewfinder with dual magnification might offer a practical solution, similar to some Japanese rangefinder cameras, providing photographers with flexibility and usability. The X-Pro series has evolved significantly since its inception, once being Fujifilm's flagship camera, known for its power, flexibility, and versatility. However, with the rise of models like the X-T series and X-H1, the X-Pro series has faced some pressure on its status. Despite debates about the diminishing functionality of the X-Pro3, there remains a strong demand for X-Pro cameras, particularly the X-Pro2, indicating that Fujifilm fans are fervently anticipating the X-Pro4.